the 2-1. Gets into it, sends it into left center field. Long run for Trauben. Zubsik over from center, and Zubsik can't make the catch. It's off the edge of his glove and lands at the base of the left center field wall. Gant around second and dives in safely head first to third. The 2-1. Swings and lifts it into left field. Troutman is there. Makes the catch. Tagging from third is Gant, and the throw to the plate is cut off, and the Cougars strike first, taking a 1-0 lead here in the home half of the first. And the 0-1, runner goes, fastball is a strike, throw down to second base, and it's a little bit too high. So Raycar with a steal of second. Home runs, 12 runs batted in. The 1-0, curveball, a little tapper down to the third baseline. Briggs charges, bare hands, throws to first base, and not in time, and now trying to sneak home is Raycar, and no throw. Cougars take a 2-0 lead. The 0-1, ground ball, deflected off the glove to the second baseman, Crespo. He flips to second for one, and the throw to first base is in the dirt. Bounces into foul territory. Holler's going to come all the way around to score, and it's a 3-0 lead for Charleston. 1-2 pitch. And a bouncer hit towards the right side, scooped up by Harding, goes to first. So that'll be the second out, but now that wild pitch looms large as it allowed Crespo to get down to third now and score on that little be next year for Murray. 1-1 one, one, and a base hit to right field. Rodriguez around third base. This time they'll send him. Myers, throw to the plate, is cut off. Rodriguez scores. Ray Carr with an RBI, his 20th of the year. An all-time wins at Davidson with 20. And that one's lifted in the air to left. Rodriguez on the run, angling near the line, makes the catch, tagging from third is Crespo, and the throw is off the mark towards home plate, so Crespo will score easily, and Appalachian State trying to chip away at this lead for Charleston. The pitcher for Wofford just groomed one right down the middle of the plate, just like that one right there. Base hit to right field. Crowl around third base and goes through the stop sign. The throw home is up the line, though, so Crowl will score, and the Cougars now take a 5-2 lead. One out, one on here on the bottom of the sixth in the 0-1 pitch. Harding a line drive, base hit into left center field. He's come through again. Ray Carr around third base. He will score easily, and Charleston takes a 6-2 lead. So he's in scoring position with two gone on the 2-1 pitch. Aldrich gets underneath it and skies it high in the air to right center. Zubsik to the track at the wall, and it is gone. Daniel Aldrich with a two-run homer here in the bottom of the eighth inning. And the Cougars now take a 10-5 lead. Aldrich with his 21st home run of the season. And the 0-2 curveball popped up. Shortstop Holler running into the outfield, blowing over his head. Raycar comes in from center, and Holler over the shoulder makes the catch to end the game. What a play by Jamie Holler. So popped up into shallow left. The wind has been blowing out towards left center field. I think it was Jamie who made the catch. Looking directly behind him, a blind catch. Unbelievable catch by Holler. I'm not even sure if he saw it. Just stuck his glove out there, makes the catch, and this one is finally over.